second graders at Fernway Elementary in Shanker Heights, Ohio. I'm Natural Smarty. Join me on this virtual hike looking for spring wildflowers. You know, there's many signs of spring. We have colorful and noisy birds from South America and the Southern US arriving right now, and they may nest in those trees. Look up into those trees and you'll also see another sign of spring. Maybe the trees are flowering. You'll see little buds. And then the lime green leaves are gonna emerge. But you know what else? Look down to the forest floor. That's one of my favorite signs of spring. There's going to be a parade of color, spring wildflowers. So join me for a few days. I'm gonna find a few of these wildflowers. Each of them has their own little story on how it might get pollinated and reproduce. And we're gonna be looking for plants just like that. Are you ready? We're witnessing one of the major signs of spring here. Listen for the peeping. There are multiple frogs out there and they're called spring peepers. And second graders, take a look at the top of that forest called the forest canopy. There's no leaves up there. And that allows for the sunlight to reach the forest floor. And that's exactly what the wildflowers need to emerge. We've got one, Harbinger of Spring. Often overlooked because it hides so well among the forest floor and all these dried leaves. His nickname, its curious nickname is Pepper and Salt. I wonder why its nickname is Pepper and Salt. That wildflower with the yellow petals is called yellow trout lily. But did you notice the leaves, the speckled leaves? That's how it gets its name, the yellow trout lily, as in brook trout, fish, because those spots and the speckles remind people of that trout. If you see these in the wild, growing out of the forest floor, when you see one leaf, not two, but just one, it means that that plant is not mature yet. You're not gonna see a flower this year. In fact, it could take seven years for this ant pollinated plant to actually grow a flower. All right, second graders. Spring wildflowers are just one of the many signs of spring. I'm Natural Smarty. Thanks for coming along on this virtual hike. Be sure to get out there and look for your own signs of spring and listen too. They come and go fast, so good luck.